Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh Whenever you are, whenever you are Today we'll talk about the power of the television Inside the hotel rooms I was invited to attend the board meeting Of Islamic Leaf Germany in Cologne And I was met in the airport By the country director of the CEO Mr. Tariq And who took me to the hotel The hotel was about three to four star hotel In the center of the city of Cologne And I went to the room at about nearly six, seven o'clock in the evening. And he told me that he'll come back and pick me up at half past eight. I went to my room and some of my habit could be a good or bad habit. I just was actually fl- clicking through the channels to see if there's Arab TV, uh, Arab channels or not. And I sat down on my bed and I opened the, uh, I switched on the, tele- the, 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 the television and uh, I was looking and going through the, the channels and I was shocked to see a hard core pornography, a br- br- pornography channel there. I was shocked, don't know what to do. Usually in this kind of hotel, they warn the guests of having this or they make it as a paid so you don't actually touch them. Uh, but I did not know what to do. And therefore, there was a big this struggle between the devils surrounding me who are pushing me strongly to keep watching, to keep watching, to keep watching, and the angels of my whole culture pulling me back to tell me, leave the room, leave the room, leave the room. What to do to save myself from that? First of all, I switch off the television, and this fight or this struggle between the two sides was there destroying myself. Switch off the light and run out of the uh, uh, room, uh, running, running, running. And this, this, this fight or this war between the devils and the angels were there, there. And for me, I was alone. Nobody can see me. I can do whatever I want. Oh, nobody can touch me. So, I ran down to the reception and I was waiting for Tariq for an hour. Being afraid that the devil might come to whisper to my ear and tell me, go, you forgot something in the room, go and get it. And by the time I go to the room another time, I switch on the light, then I switch on the television and I start watching the things again. Tariq came and uh, I was yeah, desperate to see him. I said, why well, you are sitting downstairs? Why not? I, said, I told him the story. I was laughing. Then I told me, okay, can I change the hotel? He said, you can't because the, 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 the city is full. There's a lot of conferences, a lot of exhibitions, and, 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 and. And he took me with him to have my dinner. And I was reluctant to go back to my room. I wanted to stay as long as I can to feel tired, to feel exhausted. So when I go back to my room, I just fall on my de- bed to sleep. I, and they turned me back to the hotel like a prisoner, oppressed, oppressed prisoner who is facing an unpredictable fate, whether he's going to be victorious or failing. And I went to my room, but I made a plan what to do. First of all, I took the remote and put it in one of the drawers to resist myself seeing the remote in front of you. Then I wanted to pray Isha because I didn't pray Isha. And Allah guided me to pray to Raka'ah for Qiyam al I said, okay, that's fine. Let me start doing it. And I was not one of the good people who actually are very good in making Qiyam al So I stood in the first two Raka'ah inside this fight. From my right hand side, the angels are empowering me. From my left hand side, the devils are actually whispering at my my ears to finish quickly and go back to watch whatever it is. I succeeded in completing the first two rakah with about 40% success to 45%. Then I went on to the second rakah, then more and more and more till I became exhausted and tired and jumped into my bed to try to sleep. And alhamdulillah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala showered his sakina on me, so I slept like a fish, and I woke up 
next morning alhamdulillah so here my the, the lesson to learn from there is whenever you are in the hotel be careful not to touch the television or if you do be careful of controlling yourself if something like this happened to you now we develop something else inshallah i'll see you in khartoum about another television inshallah assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh